all and welcome back to another Skyrim Creation Kit Bootcamp reference video. Today we're going to be talking about the object window. The object window is usually open by default in the Creation Kit, but it might somehow get closed by accident, so you'll need to know how to open it for yourself from time to time. In order to do that, go to the toolbar at the top of the Creation Kit and go to the View menu. From there, select the Object Window option. If that doesn't reveal your object window, then the window might be hidden under another window or behind the creation kit itself. Once your object window is open, you'll notice that there are several categories. Each category has a series of subcategories as well. From the top, the Actors subcategory holds the NPC and related player data, including perk information. The next category, Audio, includes music, sound effects, and ambient background effects. The character category contains race, class, and faction information, as well as other technical data about characters. The items category contains the things that your character can use in the world, such as weapons, armor, books, keys, ingredients, and soul gems. The magic category holds all of the spells, words of power, scrolls, and potions that are used in the game. The miscellaneous category is used mostly for technical framework, but it also includes load screen data. The Special Effects category, as the name implies, carries most of the special effects in the game, such as explosions, debris, and hazards. It also contains image spaces. The World Data category contains climate, weather, location, and encounter zones. Finally, the World Objects category contains most of the stuff that you see or interact with in the game, such as buildings, treasure chests, trees, and lights. In order to find something in the object window, you can either search for it by finding a subcategory and manually searching through all of the results, or you can filter the search with a partial or full name. For example, if I know I wanted to find part of the farm in tile set, I might enter in in the filter search. If I wasn't sure which category it would be located under, I would make sure all is selected. If I knew it would be in the world objects category, but I wasn't sure which subcategory it would be in, I would still have to search under all, because you can't search for something under the top level category. If you know what the subcategory is, you can search this subcategory with the filter search. You can also search with the wildcard asterisk if you are unsure of the exact wording. For example, I might search for farm asterisk in. This would bring up anything from farm in 01 to farm int in wall entrance 01 meaning it returns anything from nothing between the two words to other things between the two words. You can also preview something in the object window by right-clicking the object and selecting Preview. Finally, if you follow these steps but you don't see much or anything listed in the search results, then make sure that you've loaded Skyrim.esm in the Creation Kit. If nothing is loaded, then nothing is going to show up. This should help to familiarize you with the object window layout and functionality. Thanks for watching.